Hey, how's it going? This is Sean. So for today's tutorial, I'm gonna teach you how to write a controller which can have the both subscriber and the publisher in the same file. And you know, sometimes you want your robot to listen to something and do the reaction, and you you wanted to send the information or publish something or whatever. So let's get started. So the very first thing I need you guys to do is to create. The uh the controller dot cpp as in the same folder with the talker and the listener, and just open it as an empty file. And the next thing you need to do is to open the cmake list. Where the cmake list is in here. That just do the same thing that we did in the last tutorial. So we can simply just copy and paste it that old code and change this to the controller. Okay, controller, controller, controller controller okay let's save it and then you open the controller here we just start writing our uh, main code today so uh, we can just copy and, and reuse some old thing here like this part so we copy the uh, libraries and you know the main function here so that's pretty easy huh and return zero here so and, and we need to change the name to the controller okay so if we want to write the uh, subscriber and publisher in the same file we need to uh, define the class also the class name we use it name as a controller here and we uh, need to define the variable uh, of the, uh, the publisher and the subscriber so we write the private part first the ROS node handle okay so Oh, I saw that. Yes. Oh, come on. Node handle and Ross subscriber and Ross publisher. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Let's make some indentors. It's a lot more clear. And we need to write a public part of it. Okay, so the first thing we need to do is the uh, constructor which will be running as we initialize this class. So we can also reuse some old thing that we did in here, like the how we initialize our subscriber. So we just copy and paste it here. We are still listening to the chatter because we are using we are gonna using the talker that the old the old talker that we created before. So in here we need to change the callback function, which we need to specify the callback function in our class, and also for the uh, yes the publisher. So we just oh come on we just copy and paste this part, and maybe I'm gonna trying to publish to another topic, like so I just name it as another topic, yes. And here, there's one thing we need to do is to write in the callback function here. So void callback, and I think we can, because we are we are lazy, we are lazy. So just copy this code, put in here the curly brace, and also we need to defining our um. Or publish string. So this time we go. We call it the pub string, and we need to do something to defining the string here that we get from the uh, uh, the subscriber. So just just like what we did before. So here we I'm gonna just write a uh, controller here and. Put this thing to point to the data. Oh, sorry. And six string. Yeah, let me check. Yes, yeah, right. So. <laughs> so the next thing we need to do is to. Uh, put this string into our 
um, publish the string, and we can just you know output as a on the, on the console and see to, to to see what's happening over there. So the data C string, okay, and standard and line. That's cool. So don't for and don't forget to publish the thing the publish the messages to the publisher using the publish function where is the uh, publish string and we need to spin once to make sure that we keep doing this thing and that's it that's the uh I think that's the callback function so right now the only thing we need to do is to initialize the controller so initialize it and spin outside in a in a main function I think that's pretty much it. Just just trying to cat game make. It's the build uh building our project. And you will see oh there's um arrow, let's see what's what is that? Oh standard end line. I need this. Just trying to build again. Cool, so you will see that. We build the talker and we build the controller. So let's make it smaller here. So we can write use raw score to start the system, and we run the talker here in this console and the, uh, the controller in this. So you will see uh, the hello world, which is the messages that we publish to the uh, the topic, the hello world with the count, and uh, the controller here. It's the code I'm writing inside the controller. So that can be another thing, that can be a function, whatever you wanted to process in this data. And and I just you know to just output to the console to see the result. So um to virtually uh see what's happening here, we can check in the Rust topic in for list Rust topic list and can you will see the chatter and another topic. So if we Rust topic Info the chatter, the chatter. Come on, come on. Yes, chatter. You will see the publisher is the talker and the subscriber is the controller. And if we see another topic, another, another topic. Oh, typo, typo, typo all the time. So you will see that the publisher is the controller, but still don't have the uh, subscriber yet. So that's pretty much it. You are. I just create yeah the controller which have both the subscriber and the publisher. So for the next tutorial, I'm gonna give you a example of the implementation of the uh, what we learned so far. So see you next time. Peace.